Hey guys, Coach Backpail UK here, and I am finally back after nearly six months of me being gone. I'm finally back on YouTube, which is really cool, which is great. I'm really happy about it. Hope you've missed me. Yeah, um, I'm back, and I'm just going to show you my really messy and untidy wheel trim collection sorry about the camera it's like kind of oh is that better i think that's better okay so i'm basically sorting out my wheel trims so it's a big mess right now i'll just a little bit back so you can see my my shed so yeah, this is it, so I will show you my collection. As I said, it's really messy because I'm sorting all of them out, trying to sell a few as well. So yeah. The rare ones on the shed. It's a really nice day today, so it's good. It's really warm in this shed as well. Um, that number plates are that number plate has fallen down for some reason from here. But got a lot of um, spider webs and cobwebs, especially behind the wheel trims. Is a bit annoying which I'm gonna have to clean with like an old broomstick or something so yeah piles are a bit messy because as I said I'm sorting them out and also not much not much has changed but as you can see there are these like green fences they're actually like um puppy cages, dog crates or cages for dogs, you know, whatever you want to call them. And I actually want to put them up here. So like the wheel trims don't fall down. They're not really falling down. I don't have a problem with that, but just, you know, just in case, just to be safe, I'm going to put them up. They're my dog's old fences from when he was a puppy. So yeah, all of these wheel trims that you see here on the left are wheel trims that I'm planning to sell. These huge piles, these stacks, and a few of these wheel trims here. I'm planning to sell all of these, and these are just, you know, the ones that I'm going to keep that aren't really in good condition or would just be a shame to throw away. I just keep them here. And as you can probably remember, or probably not, I used to have like shit wheel trims here. But I've thrown them all away. These are just bags with aftermarkets because I used to have a lot of aftermarkets. And I just don't collect them anymore. So yeah, I've thrown them all away. And also, I will show you the wheel trims in my room. So, the only thing that has really changed, well not really, but there's been a big change to these shelves. I've got these center caps and badges. I've got an Audi Rover, Fiat, Polish Fiat and Polonez, Daewoo. Nissan, Lancia, Big Ford badge, Peugeot 306, Nissan, Toyota, Volkswagen, another Volkswagen. And there are some still to come when I get them. They'll just go here. And same here. It's a cool scooter. Volkswagen, really, really nice Fiat. Seat. This and Sunny, really nice Rover, Peugeot, and three Reynolds. This is a really, really cool one. It's actually metal as well, but I don't want to touch it. 
Clio and just a normal Renault and just this picture, you know, Route 66 in America. And the wheel trims, Peugeot Partner, this has always been here. A missing one, there used to be a Fiat Studio one here but I took it down. Mint condition new Volkswagen Golf, Mercedes C-Class, Toyota RAV4, some kind of really rare Alfa Romeo, an Audi, I've forgotten what model, Polish Fiat 126P, Volkswagen Caddy from England, Dacia Sandero, mint condition Renault Clio and Peugeot Boxer from England and also this cool calendar I've got a Mustang this month so yeah bye on the calendar I mean bye